Hello there, viewers, and welcome to Lumberjack Dynasty. This is literally straight after the previous episode. It takes about a week and a few days afterwards to actually dry the planks. So, that's not a good thing. So, I would like to actually progress with the storyline. So then I can actually be productive whilst I'm actually skipping the days for planks to dry. So I need to go to the mountain top over there, meet the guy up here. Top of the mountain, talk to shopkeeper, you might learn something useful. He seems to have an eye on things. And the way for me to be productive is to have chickens, cows, or even sheep, maybe, going whilst I'm skipping so I can actually collect the eggs or gather up the milk. So if I sound a bit off, I'm just wondering how I am going to climb this zonking mountain, but I've just gone past this one. There's a hotel and a small store nearby. Maybe it's worth talking to the owner. Okay then, let's do you first, because you're practically right here, and I might have to actually walk up the mountain myself. So whilst I'm skipping, I can actually collect up resources to sell, which means I'm actually earning something. Hello. There we go. Come closer. I'm sure you'll find something you like. Care to trade? What exactly are you selling? What exactly are you selling? Food mostly. Fresh food from our beautiful land. Mushrooms and fish. I also buy these commodities. So come to see me if you have some to spare. Awesome. How's business? How's business? Honestly, it could be better. I bought a piece of land, bought this hotel and the store. Once they finished the ski jump, I thought there'll be loads of tourists bringing in loads of money. But now it looks like they'll never finish it. How come? I remember three companies trying to finish this building. None of them got permission. The mayor's office blocks everything. No idea why. I would have sold the hotel a year ago. But of course, no one wants to buy. So here I am, trading fish and mushrooms, waiting for better times. Oh, okay then. So I'm just gaining information. So Care to trade? trade? Oh, hello. You have a recipe book. You know what? I will buy that. Food? Ooh. Even better. Okay, tools. All right then. So, you buy fish, too, but not at them prices. Okay. Is that it? Okay then. Check your map. All right then. Okay then. I'll check it. And. That seems to be that. Huh. Okay then. That's great. No. Let's go ahead and read the book. Go read this book. Congratulations. You just learnt new recipes for neat egg dish. Brilliant. So. Oh, hello. New skill learnt. Alright then. That is good. Oh, wait a sec. Oh yeah, the guy said it's not working. So... Climb the... Mountain? I guess. Information. Talk to shopkeeper. You might learn something useful. He seems to have an eye on things. Yep, I know.
Okay then, at the top. Finally. Okay, the Hello. Me. Can I offer you anything? Uh, okay then. What exactly are you selling? Food. But I used to sell those herbal potions the young herbalist used to make. Those sold like hotcakes, believe me. People bought a lot after climbing all the way up here. Delicious and refreshing. Sadly, she doesn't make them anymore. Ask my sister, Natalie. Perhaps she has a bottle or two left. Nan has a store by the observation tower near the lumber mill. Oh, information. Stunning view up here. Yeah, the view, the air. At least that's something. You don't sound too happy. Happy? I have invested all my money into this place here. Expected jumpers, fans, TV. But the fact is, only a few climbers came by every now and then. Will it ever be completed? Nah, I don't think so. It's been like this for years. Can't do anything without paying the mayor a share, I tell ya. He's got his hands in everything around here. Uh-oh. Care to trade? Okay, what? <laughs> uh, okay, uh, additional clothing, more charisma and sales money, but not so good for hard work. Okay then, better strength and stamina, but not much luck with sales and ladies. Ooh, so I get better clothing to help me out, okay? A racing drone, small drone, different foods. Okay then, so is that it? I actually wanted to have information on how to buy chicken, sheep and cows so I can make a profit whilst skipping the days drying my planks. All I'm getting is information. Let's go down the ski slope. Whee! A perfect 10. And because I'm doing missions, let's meet Sasha. There you go. Hello there. Can I get out? Thank you very much. Good day, ma'am. How are you? Oh, hi there. And who might you be? I'm Charles's nephew, bringing his old lumber mill up to scratch. Great. How can I help you? That forklift over there. Is it yours? Are you selling? Hmm. I have not yet thought of selling, but why not? What do you offer? I can't invest much money, but maybe I can lease it. Or I could work for it, too. I could use some help indeed. See this old forest just by the gate? I need this clean, completely, bushes too. And I need those logs stored too. I can offer the forklift if you do this for me. Interested? Yes, of course. Thanks. Cut all the trees and bushes first. Then I will show you where to store the logs. You know what? I'm going to have someone in the comments going... Uh, you should have realized that you was going to get a forklift for free. No, I didn't realize I was going to get a forklift for free. I even tried to nick this forklift at one point. And I couldn't. And I bought a new one. I hate myself so much. I really, really do hate myself so much. I have got a log in my hands. And I only needed one more log to complete this mission. That is now complete, but if we go over here... There are logs still lying about, which is awesome. So I'm going to take these 
up to the road. Drop them there, ready for when I bring the log trailer. That one can go there. Now, let's go ahead, pick up you. Bring you up to the other one. I don't know what I'm going to call this episode because... I've met some people, learnt some information, and did a logging job, which is awesome. Gained a forklift. Oh, I'm too tired. Okay then, that's fine. Let's leave that there then. And... That's it, really? He hasn't been really progressive as I wanted it to be? I was hoping that these missions would open up information about animals and that, because these are stores. So let's go and talk to the wonderful lady. Job's done. The logs are all where you need them. Nice. Thank you. The forklift is yours, as promised. You are a good help. I'll tell my friends about you. Oh, your friends. Well, thank you very much. The forklift is now yours. Awesome. <laughs> I can't believe it. Get another forklift. So what I'm going to do is drive all my vehicles back to the vehicle shop, which is here. And I'm going to sell one of the uh, forklifts. Well, as you can see, the old one and the new one. Well, I think it's obvious that I would like to sell this one. Two grand. Okay, then. How much for you? Two grand. Okay, then. 70, 90. Okay, but this is high capacity. And you were just an old forklift. Oh, look. Huh. 50 40. Alright, so. You'll have to pay for a new forklift anyway? Okay then. At least you have gave me half my money back. So sell you. There we go. Now I can actually take this back to a farm. I still don't know how to get sheep or chickens or anything and I don't really fancy skipping or drying anything out until I've got a nest egg as in I've got income coming in whilst I'm actually skipping days so I'm actually earning something instead of skipping and not earning nah all. Oh. I can't do the local investor because I actually need dry plants for that so that is it I know this is going to be a strange episode everywhere and everywhere my talking won't be 100% because I'm confused and I don't know what I'm actually doing I'm trying to find out things and trying have things go in the right order, shall I say? To allow me to progress with this game better and not allow it to progress and feel boring and me go, oh, you know what? There's no point of me continuing. I don't want that to happen. Farm Dynasty got like that kind of a way. This, I would like to actually achieve something. I would love to do up the lumber mill as well as the farmyard. Meet more people, get animals in. 
But you know what? This is the end of the episode. Another episode down. Missions accomplished. Meeting the neighbours. I don't know what to do apart from cutting down trees and drying planks. And that's it. Really? Hmm. We'll see in the next one. Bye.